My grandfather was a businessman, a founder of the Hudson Motor Car Company, a visionary auto executive, and the U.S. Secretary of Commerce under Herbert Hoover. My grandfather was running Hudson at the time, but had the idea to introduce a, a closed body car to the mass market. Now, we take these closed body cars today for granted, but uh, cars mostly back then were, were all open bodies. They were all convertibles. The result for him was the new Essex Coach, which changed really America's view of, uh, of cars. By 1929, 90% of them imitated the Hudson Motor Car Company and Essex with the closed body. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a very happy occasion and one which we surely have a good right to celebrate with mutual congratulations and a spirit of optimism. Well, the Terraplane applied aircraft imagery to the automobile. Those of us who fly owe much to those who have pioneered and developed the automobile. Perhaps our largest step to the motor car is for its part in making the general public conscious of the advantages of high speed and mobile methods of transportation. Sweetie. What do you suppose that these kids of ours are going to turn out to be? There was no question that my grandfather was a very busy man, but when he wasn't at work, he spent his entire time with his family in Gross Point. <laughs> well, there's a lot of give and take in a big family like this, and they'll have to learn. They will learn. Well, speaking of giving, do you know that they're the most generous children, I think, that there are in the world? Well, whenever there's a celebration, a birthday or a Christmas, they certainly prove that they think of others. You know, it's important to remember that some of his most notable successes coincide with the Great Depression. He was called to Washington to serve a slightly greater cause. Mr. Chapin, it gives me great pleasure to welcome you to the Department of Commerce as you assume the office of secretary. At a time when it was extremely uh, inconvenient, let's say, for him to leave the automotive industry, he went to serve as Secretary of Commerce. A nationwide movement is now being actively pushed in an effort to divide up existing work and return our unemployed to their natural industries and occupations. When he came back, he, he, that was one of the things that resulted in his death, in my opinion, was that he just overworked so, trying to catch back up the, the, the slack or the lack of momentum that had occurred at Hudson during his absence. I never met my grandfather because he died before I was born, but I am immensely proud of what he did and his contribution to the automotive industry. Mm -hmm.